Hey Simleys, it's Delicracy here and welcome to Let's Play The Sims 4 Jungle Adventure Part 5 and I've got a bit of sad news but I get a bit of exciting news as well. I think this is going to be the last part of this series. Um, I think, you know, it's always difficult to know how long a series is going to go for and I'm actually excited to still use the Jungle Adventure Pack implemented into other LPs by being just looking at a lot of your feedback, looking at the views, um, looking at the engagement. And I don't think this um, LP is particularly popular for you guys. And I actually asked on my stream today how many of you guys would be happy us moving on to a new LP. And most of you guys were pretty chill about that. Or I'm like, yeah, I'd like to see a new LP. Um, so that is what we're going to do. We're actually going to make this the last part, but I think we've done a good job exploring the pack and seeing, you know, all, all, all the bits about it. Um, so yeah, anyway, I hope you guys aren't too sad. I always feel bad and kind of sad finishing LPs off, but then again, it doesn't mean that we can't reuse the characters. Um, and I don't know, I feel like the Jungle Adventure pack, it's a bit hard with storytelling uh, with this pack, only soul or just mainly using this pack. Uh, I think I'd like to do like a mixed pack kind of thing. So yeah, that, that's my thoughts, you guys. I hope that's okay with you. Um, and yeah, be excited for more Let's Plays, more Let's Play, new Let's Play. And uh, do let me know if any of these characters you would like to see more of. Anyway, Belle is working away here. Now, off camera, I did do a few things. I did go to the market and get all of the Sims some waterfall in a bottle. I've also filled their inventories with fire foam. I did get a wellness treat uh, for Gus the dog. And they've all got a little bit of food in there. And yay, we just opened up this pathway, which... When I originally came to do this, it was closed. Like everything was closed. I couldn't really go anywhere. The temple route was closed too. So it's good to be back. Belle is blazing a trail through the thick jungle when she stumbles upon a campsite. It's a pretty remote location and she doesn't see anyone nearby, but she's not sure if it's actually been abandoned. Should Belle take a look around, avoid the campsite, quietly look around, higher fitness skill leads to better results, or arm self with insulation powder. I'm definitely gonna use that. Belle cautiously approaches the campsite, armed with insulation powder as a form of protection. Nothing seems to be amiss, so Belle helps herself to an artifact that appears to be abandoned. Suddenly, a well-dyed Sim rushes her. What? Belle sprays the insulation powder in the crazed Sim's face and escapes with her prize. Okay, then. <gasps> is this the same temple we went to last time? I feel like it is. I, wait, have we discovered a new temple or the same temple? I guess we'll see if it's got a different floor plan. Uh, Cause I can't even remember. Oh, it looks exactly the same. It looks very much the same and I'm pretty sure that's our tent. <laughs> so we're in the same temple. Wait, but it's different. Wait, no, what, what? This is the same temple, but a different temple, you guys. Okay, well, let's let's scan around. Let's bring the whole, let's bring everyone here. Uh, and hopefully we'll, we'll kill one of the Sims off because I did want to see the poison death in this. <laughs> I was kind of excited for that. And I also sent, I also digged up an emerald and sent that um, off camera as well. So hopefully Belle gets that back soon. I don't even know how to get it back. We just sent it off. And we don't have a letterbox, so I don't know. Anyway, let's establish this uh, excavation site. Is there anything up here on the roof? No, we've just got another excavation um, pile, which is fine. Are you actually that tired? Oh, she's tired, you guys. Uh, you know what? I think we ha I think Estella had an energy drink. Let's just give that to Jade. I know it's really bad to drink energy drinks, but I just feel like, you know, it might be okay. All right, so let's excavate together. Let's bring everyone here. What? They're all tired. Yeah. Well, Bell can Bell can do everything for everyone. <laughs> okay, he's back. He's feeling inspired. Excellent. Excellent. Okay, let's dig this away. Uh, let's just see if we can find anything. Would be good to. He's also going to need to go to the bathroom. Actually, you know what? I might get it. I might get him to go to the bathroom quickly. I, quickly oh and we just found a relic base but we need the relic top seems to be a lot easier to find the bases uh yeah we just found another one um jade found a fossil rock all right well let's take this 
opportunity for her to have a tinkle time. We're also going to eat a couple of these cheesy ready to eat thingamabobs. Okay, and where are you, girl? Oh, she's here. She's in her pajamas. She looks really, really sad. Um, can you look, girl? Go to the toilet first. Go to the toilet before exploring. Put some clothes on, for goodness sakes. Oh my god, fine. If she wants to go down there, she totally can. Let's try to pass. We actually, like, obviously, we're not going to be able to, but I think it'll be funny. She's just in her pajamas. She didn't want to be left out. She loves being the center of attention. She's like, I can get through here. Oh, no, she didn't. Oh, whoa. Wait, I didn't think she would. Yeah. Whoa, whoa. I didn't. Okay, good. She's putting herself out. <laughs> actually, she's not going to. Wow. Actually, you know what? She's going to. She won't die if she's got all of this good stuff in her inventory. So let's get rid of some of this. We want to make Estella more susceptible to dying. What is wrong with us? We are so mean. Uh, let's just do some random activations over here. She already looks so haggard. She's just gone off her head. She wants the treasure for herself. She wants to like be rich. What's going on here? Okay, we got some bone dust by the looks of things. Uh, let's make an offering to the leaves glyph. Whoa, what a rush. Stella has gained some archaeology skill for narrowly avoiding disaster. Okay, maybe we got burn dust this time. She's just gaining skills. This trip is actually benefiting her when we're trying to kill her off. What does that mean? What does that mean, you guys? Uh, I don't know. Okay, let's get you to use a couple of things. Oh my god, she opened the gate? Guys, who would have thought Estella would make it through? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Okay, she's opened the gateway herself and she's like, I'm going to go in and find everything. Uh, let's just get you to... Oh, no, don't place in the world. Don't place in the world. He's just having a little snoozle. Jade's like, hey, Estella, wait up. You don't want to go there by yourself when you don't know anything about this. Jade's a nice girl. She's going to go with Estella. Estella's like, I'm sick of waiting around. I want the treasure. Okay, what is this? Why don't we get um, Jade to be smart and activate some, uh, examine some things, whereas Estelle is like, who cares? Oh gosh, she's now on fire. Oh no, and she's got nothing in her inventory. Oh fine, we'll, we'll let her extinguish herself. Look at all these skeletons, they're so cool. Hello, Bob, Jerome, Lionel, Oh, wait, we can't say Lionel. That's that's too soon off to Twins LP. Marcus. Eugene. Priscilla. Gordon. Okay. What happened now? Uh, she just got dusted. I want to get poisoned. We want to poison her already. How do we get poisoned? And how do we get poisoned enough to, to die? Uh, a poison dart! Yes! It's sticking out of Estella. Guys, she's... She's poisoned. Yes. She looks so... Oh my gosh. Girl. Girl. <laughs> oh god, I'm so cruel to my sims. Look at this. She's poisoned. She's caught on fire. This is why you should not go into a temple by yourself and be greedy. I wonder how you, how you die from poison. <gasps> we got a second dart, you guys. She got double darted. It hasn't done anything though. Do we continue on? I mean, it seems to be that we know it's this one because it can't be anything else. Hey, she opened it up because of Jade. Okay. Okay, she may be about to wee herself, but she has made it. <gasps> Treasure, yes. Sorry, I keep saying yes too much. All fruit is more pl flavorful. Perhaps still can even stomach an airplane food right now. <laughs> uh, she found some wondrous items in the treasure chest. She took an artifact, some adventure gear, and a mystical relic and put them in her inventory. What did we get? What did we get? Uh, we got a base. We got a skull. We got a flower. And, and we have more bone dust. Well, that's not... It's not that good. I mean, we don't want the bases. We want, we want the, um, 
We want the tops of the relics. <laughs> what? She got it in the first go? No way. Should we play with this? Blame for temple dangers. She can just let out some emotion on this guy. What was that? We're just testing all of the defenses. Nothing happened to her? Oh. She gained some charisma? Okay, let's get her to go down here. Let's go, girl. Do, 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 do. I can't believe she just got into the temple herself just from being savage. I think what we'll do is bring Hugo here. He can teleport to Estella and be like, why would you go here by yourself? He'll be really angry at her. Hello, random one skeleton. Okay, let's do the usual thing that we do. We just go down here and we're going to activate a few different things. He's like, Estella, what are you doing down here? Let's be mean to her. Let's yell at her and be like, what are you doing? He's like, damn, she looks so so fine having that, that water, water bottle shower. He's like, you cannot come here by yourself and get into a temple. He's like, I don't care. I want new things. I want new jewelry and I'm going to make us rich. Okay, activate. Reach into the glyph hole. This is going to open it up for us. And yes, we got to the ancient treasure chest. Let's get Estella to run over to the treasure chest before him. He'll be like, what? Oh, there's another treasure chest over here. But this is a good one because it's really like pretty. It's really like pretty. Yes, girl. Temple exploration complete. She found the ultimate treasure of the temple. <gasps> she should take a look around. What did we get? What? Oh, we got it. Oh my gosh. We got a jeweled calendar plate worth 10,000 simoleons. Holy dooly. Oh my gosh. That is crazy. And maybe we'll get Hugo to come over here and be like, Estella, give me, give me the treasure. Uh, we got some, Omni we got an Omniskin mask. We got, oh, we got a freezer bunny statue. Awesome. So we've got quite a few things to take back. He's like, give me the plate, Estella. Well, I swear I will leave you here in the temple all by yourself. It's like, it's mine. I'm going to sell it for my new Maserati. <laughs> Something like that. If I had 10,000 Simoleons, won't buy a car in the Sims 4 because we don't have cars. And I reckon he's going to go home and leave her in the middle of the jungle. She's just going to fend for herself. Maybe he like snatched it from her. Let's grab everything and just leave her in the jungle. <gasps> Whoa, we got a machete too. Oh my gosh. He's going to take like all of her survival gear and just leave her. And hopefully she dies of poison. Okay, so I'm going to dig up this crystal because I just had a thought. I wonder if we can refine crystals at the archaeology table ourselves and we don't actually have to send them to the jeweler, which means that... We can get this relic put together like now. Okay, come on girl. I really want you to work on this crystal because I really want this relic to be put together and see what happens. <laughs> Shaven. Okay, girl. Keep on working it. Keep on working that crystal. Okay, she is getting uncomfortable. I think Jade, I mean Jade. Oh my God, we did it, you guys. We did it. It's like a little plum bob crystal. Oh my gosh, you guys, this is the moment. This is the... This is the moment and she's having a bath. What are you doing, girl? <laughs> Why? 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 Okay, you know what? It's fine. It's fine. You need to be in a good mood. I understand. We will look after our Sims. Let's just eat some razzleberries to make you happy. That was it? That was it! I thought there was going to be something more exciting! So what does this mean? What do we do? Activate on self. So he's like, Jade, I need to activate this on you. And we'll see what happens. And Jade's like, uh, I might ask... I might ask Belle if that's okay first. And he'll be like, nope. You wanted to be a part of this experience? 
You will be a part of this experience. Oh my gosh, she's running away. She's like, no, Hugo. He looks so evil. Oh my gosh. What just happened? <gasps> oh, she's a skeleton, you guys. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. Jade has been blessed by becoming a skeleton. This will last a short time. She should be careful with meals. It doesn't look like there is a stomach to catch that food. Oh my lord. This is awesome, you guys. I love her. Okay, I'm so glad we got to figure out what one of the relics do. That is so cool. I think what we'll do is um, we might just get Belle. Actually, you know what? We can probably get Jade to come over here and authenticate this knife. Whoa, that's our $10,000 plate, you guys. That is crazy. That is beautiful. I still can't get over this. We can get an antidote by transfer transferring ancient bone dust. But to be honest, I don't really want to because I'm bad. I'm naughty, you guys. I'm naughty. This is going to be the cutest little freezer bunny ever. I hope it's good quality. We also have never had anything fake either. So that's kind of interesting. After careful analysis, Jade has determined this artifa artifact. Oh, this artifact is genuine. Well done, Jade. Also, Jade has no need for hunger, no need for sleep, no need to go to the toilet or hygiene, only social and fun. Whoa. This is a really cool knife and it's in really, really good shape. We can't, yay, we can add it to our collection. So rarity common, rarity common, rarity common, but they're in excellent shape and this quality is poor, but it's rare. Interesting, interesting. Oh my gosh, look you guys. Oh no. This doesn't look like a real one, does it? Belle's expert knowledge of the Omniskin culture and the techniques of its master craftsmen have helped her determine this is a fake. It is subtle. Only a trained eye could spot the difference. Really? That looks ridiculous. It has a tongue sticking out of it and it's cross-eyed. I mean, it's really cute. I still really like it. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, we can just add that here. We have so many cool things to like take home. How much is this worth, by the way? 45 simoleons. Oh my gosh. And I love that we just have Jade here reading a book. Estella wasn't able to fight off the poisoning and it has progressed and it's gotten worse. Might want to do something about that. So it's finally progressed. Um, it is getting worse. So it does look like we need to get an antidote if we want to save her. But I want to see what this death is. So I don't think we're going to save her. I think she's just going to go nap for a little bit. I think Hugo's going to be too selfish and too excited about his own discoveries right now to even care about her, which is awful. So let's get him to look for more tre treasure and authentication processes. Uh, he does have the machete. He has a mask to authenticate. He is in it for the money, you guys. <gasps> Can we activate this? He can't. Let's activate it on Belle. He's becoming so obsessed with all the treasure. He's just going to use everything on everyone and not care about it. And Belle's probably going to be like, do not use that on me. Uh, oh, we have to insert a crystal. Oh my gosh, I didn't even realize she had turned into a skeleton already. I totally missed that. So now Belle's a skeleton as well. We have a beautiful 954 simoleon. Oh my god, we have so many. We have, did you get rich in this so quickly? Let's, we can't even put it anywhere. Okay, we're gonna just put like a really expensive statue over there. That's beautiful. So that's what a legit, uh, what a legit freezer bunny looks like as opposed to the fake one. Um, so we need to look for that crystal again. Is there a crystal around here for us to use again? Okay, you guys, so I'm back and it just took me so long to find a crystal. I actually had to end their vacation and travel back to Oasis Springs to find a crystal to put into the relic we do have. So because all of our items just went straight into our household inventory, I decided to bring them back to Selva Dorada when we came back and reorganize them into our beautiful 
I know, into our beautiful like treasure case. Um, so we've got our most expensive calendar plates here, 10,100 rare. This one is 8,000 rare. I mean, it's 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 pretty cool. I'm, I'm kind of a little bit obsessed with these. I'm really glad we found them. Um, but we do have to, oh my gosh, and um, Estella is still sick. She is on her way to death's door, which is really exciting. Um, but what we do need to do is put together this last relic. So what I'm going to do is, so this is a chaos relic. Apparently, depending on what kind of jewel you put in it, the rarity of the jewel, um, it will have a different outcome. And this one's rare. So let's let's see. Let's how we let's see how we go. Extract elements, uh, refine crystal. That's what we want to do. So let's get Belle over here doing the thing that she did before. Oh, she's looking pretty angry as well. She's feeling tense. Why are you feeling tense, girl? Why are you feeling tense when the music is over? Oh no, she needs some tunes. I love this little brush, by the way. It is so cute. Oh my gosh, Bella has mastered the archaeology skill. What a fantastic outcome for the last part of this, for the last part of this let's play. That is so cool. Belle can share her scholarly knowledge with other Sims by giving an archaeology lecture. Her ability to practice analysis on collectibles and find high quality artifacts is greatly enhanced. So it sounds like she'll be able to find higher quality artifacts with more ease. Oh, that's so sweet. Jade is just giving Gus a little bit of a brush. That is good as well. And Estella is really sick and I feel like her husband really doesn't care. And she's got, does she have like stench coming off her? Maybe she just farted, I don't know. She seems okay, but she probably doesn't realize what that poison is doing to her body. Oh my gosh, yes. We've got the refined crystal. It's actually worth 250 simoleons which is quite impressive. Okay, let's see, insert crystal. Oh my gosh, I wonder what's gonna happen. So this is the Bella Plush Chaos Relic. Ooh, we've been blessed with sunlight. Okay. Wow. Okay, so I wonder what this does. I have no idea. Okay, well, let's give it a go. Uh, where did it go? Wait, where is our relic? Oh my gosh, here it is. Uh, activate on. <laughs> Let's activate it on Hugo because he activated curses on both of the girls and made them. Uh, oh my gosh, what's wrong? We better ask what's wrong. Uh, or maybe ask to go potty. Maybe that's what he needs. Oh my god, I love Belle's walk. Oh, he needs... Okay, here we go. She's gone in here to activate it on him. He's like, Belle, what are you doing? You're kidding, right? You're not doing anything to me. What happened? What What was that? What happened? Tiara just became good friends with Hugo. Cassandra just became good friends with Hugo. Paolo came... Whoa, whoa, he suddenly has friends. The spirit of Balam has blessed Hugo with the blessing of plentiful buddies. Will this introduction to four new random sims lead to great friendships, steamy romances, bitter rivalries, or will they simply fade away? Well, that wasn't so bad. I mean, that's kind of handy. So what are our relationships? Like, how good are friends? Wow, Cassandra we're, like, really good friends with. Oh, my gosh, Morgan. They're all, like, teens. That's weird. Tiara. Oh my gosh. Tiara. Maybe we should go meet her. <gasps> Invite to join the vacation and see see what happens. See if he's interested in Tiara. He wants to use his powers and probably thinks like she's his true love. She's the only one who isn't a teen, so I feel like the teens are a little inappropriate, obviously, for obvious reasons. And Estelle is still in the green poison spot phase. Oh my God, there she is. <gasps> Wait, are we gonna get with an elder? Oh geez, I don't know if he's gonna go for an elder. Oh well, well we have a new best friend. That is nice. Oh, they're like best buddies. That is so cool. 
<laughs> oh my gosh, that is really, really cool. What a cool relic. I want to, oh my gosh, I want, I want Jade, no, I want Belle to meet someone. Okay, this is the next day later and Estella's starting to look more and more dazed. I swear she's looking worse, like... Girl, <laughs> she is not looking her best. Um, I mean, she looks fabulous, her outfit-wise, and her makeup and her hair. But uh, she is, I think, getting a little bit worse and worse in terms of her condition. So if we look at the moodlet here, it says she's poisoned with 19 hours to go. So I think what I'll do is speed up the process a little bit and check back with you guys when we have some more information about her health. Oh my god, you guys! 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 Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh, that happened so quickly! I thought there would be more of a warning and I was just sitting here and she died! We did it! We had a sim die from poison! I mean, it's really, really sad. May Estella rest in peace. We will miss her dearly. And and it's it's sad. Poor Jade feels terrible. She probably felt like she shouldn't have she should have insisted that Estella go home with her and kept a closer eye on her that she was following her. But it didn't happen, you guys. Estella did what she wanted to do. She went ahead into the temple and she did get poisoned multiple times. Uh, very sad indeed. With great discoveries comes great tragedy. Namaste. It's very sad. Oh my god. Gus is just like, yeah. I never really liked her anyway. <laughs> wow. I reckon she has a cool ghost as well. Actually, I think I've seen a picture of the ghost online. I think the ghosts have a bit of like a, um, like a misty green kind of feel about them. Oh, she gone. She's, she's, goodbye Estella. Goodbye. It would be so cool if you died in the jungle, if you got a really cool tombstone. <laughs> um, but yeah, that's her. And you know what? Her husband's asleep. He doesn't even really care. Uh, okay. <laughs> He doesn't care at all. Bell, Bell's, just, you know what? Bell never really liked Estella uh, at all. But yeah, I mean, I'm not really sure what to do with her. And Grim's just like, so you're gonna tip me or something? <laughs> anyway, you guys, I think this is kind of a. Is this a nice way to end the vacation or this LP? I don't really know. It's a bit sad. Oh, here we go. Here he goes. He's gonna mourn now. Uh, he's he's sad. He's like, oh, oh well, life goes on. I'm gonna make my breakfast now. <laughs> How can you eat your breakfast when your your dead wife is like right there? Like, dude, like, what? <laughs> oh my god, he looks so devastated, yet he just keeps making breakfast. Oh my gosh. <laughs> anyway, you guys, do let me know what you thought of this mini Let's Play in the comments down below. I am aware that a lot of you guys would have liked to see it go on for further, so I'll make sure to explore Jungle Adventure Pack more in a new LP. Uh -huh. I think a new LP will be more inclusive of more viewers, um, which I look really, really forward to. And thank you guys so much for watching this pack. I am um, watching this Let's Play. I really enjoyed it and I really enjoyed this pack as well. So yeah, really loved it. Anyway, you guys, as always, I hope you're having a lovely morning, afternoon or evening, wherever you are in the world, and I will speak to you soon.